Did you read Paul Volcker's biography yet, Sachs? No, I've not read it. Yeah, it's I mean, I'm familiar with his record, yeah. but yeah. Like at one point, Baker and Ray took Reagan and Volcker into a room off of the White House so it wasn't recorded and just said, Volcker to Volcker, the president does not want you to raise rates going into the 84 election, full stop. And Volcker's like, well, I wasn't planning on raising them. So there's a lot of politics in this, even though people claim- They'd already done enough. I mean, Volcker raised rates all the way up to like 20%. He broke the back of yeah. inflation. It created a very severe recession in, I think, 1981, 82. But by 1983, the economy was rocketing back yeah. with lower interest rates, and, and they basically had solved the inflation problem. Hopefully, we're not in that situation where Powell has to jack up rates so much to break the back of inflation, because it means that we'd be in an even- more serious recession. Right. So I hope we're not in a Volcker type situation. But just think but about that spread, Sachs. 20% versus like 3 or 4% we're trying to get to.